My name is Chloe McArdle and I am a world record holding marathon swimmer. Human beings are not designed to swim, let alone swim in freezing cold water. The English Channel is my spiritual home. It's it's my home, it's where I feel like my heart is, my destiny is, my future is. So I feel inextricably drawn to it, and yet at the same time, it torments me. When you're swimming along those last few hours, it feels like you're making no progress because the French shoreline is literally cutting away. So as you get closer, you don't, it doesn't actually look like it's any closer. It's not becoming bigger and bigger in your visual scope. It has, on many occasions, tormented me. Not every English Channel swim ends well. There are many swimmers who pull out after even just two hours of Channel swimming and are hospitalised. The longer you spend in the English Channel, the higher the chance that you're going to succumb to hypothermia. I've had a couple of really scary experiences in marathon swimming and one was in 2011 where I was pulled out of the English Channel with severe hypothermia and in emergency in hospital the doctor said that if they'd left me in the water 30 minutes longer I would have been dead. It's about pushing the human spirit. Where does our mind go and what can our body do? Do we really know our potential? When I was 19 I decided that I wanted to be the best in the world at something and I tried a few sports and I knew when I found marathon swimming, it was the one. What really drives me is using my swimming as a platform to inspire people to push their own personal boundaries and achieve their dreams. My name is Chloe McArdle and I am a world record holding marathon swimmer.